Hello. Today, we're delving into the world of sports, specifically the Asian Games, where the Philippines has a story to tell. From its historical challenges to the optimism surrounding the upcoming 19th Asian Games in Hangzhou, China, and the remarkable athletes set to represent the nation, we've got an exciting journey ahead. Welcome back to Fun Fact, your ultimate destination for intriguing and entertaining nuggets of knowledge. But first, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell, so you never miss out on our fascinating facts and updates. Let's dive right in. The Asian Games, also known as the ASEAD, stand as a quadrennial multi-sport extravaganza orchestrated by the Olympic Council of Asia OCA. It brings together athletes from diverse corners of Asia for spirited competition, fostering unity through the universal language of sports. Throughout its history, the Philippines has had a somewhat subdued performance in the Asian Games, a fact that contrasts with its rich sports legacy. The nation's medal count in these games has remained modest, falling short of the lofty expectations set by a country with a storied sporting heritage. This contrast becomes even more striking when compared to the Philippines' impressive track record in global sports, particularly in disciplines such as boxing, weightlifting, and athletics. As we set our sights on the 19th Asian Games in Hangzhou in 2023, there's a palpable sense of optimism that this could mark a turning point. While we won't dwell on the names of athletes who didn't secure medals in the past, we hold hope that this year might herald a change in the Philippines' fortunes at the Asian Games. We eagerly anticipate the nation's athletes rising to the occasion, seizing those coveted medals, and potentially paving the way for a new era of success at this prestigious continental sporting event. From the 23rd of September to the 8th of October 2023, the Philippines will be represented at the 19th Asian Games in Hangzhou, People's Republic of China, by a total of 395 athletes. Among them stands Olympic weightlifting champion Heidelin Diaz, a true symbol of Philippine sporting excellence. This year promises to be a thrilling chapter in Philippine sports history as the country aspires to achieve remarkable success on the grand stage in Hangzhou, China. Now, here are the Filipino athletes who are most likely to win gold medals in this year's Asian Games. But before we dive into their incredible stories, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss a moment of our exciting updates. Let's get started. E.J. Obiena, Pole Vault Number 1 on our list is E.J. Obiena, a standout in the men's pole vault category. When it comes to securing gold, Obiena stands as a surefire winner if everything goes according to plan. He needs to clear the bar at the height he likes, and victory will be as clear as sunshine. E.J. Obiena, currently ranked as the world's third best pole vaulter, recently added another feather to his cap by claiming the silver medal at the 2023 World Athletics Championships in Budapest, Hungary, only trailing behind the world champion, Armand Duplantis. Kayla Noel Sanchez, Swimming Number 2 on our list is Kayla Noel Sanchez, a rising star in the world of swimming. The excitement was palpable when Kayla Noel Sanchez announced her clear intent to proudly represent the Philippines in all major overseas tournaments over a year ago. Hailing from Toronto, Canada, the 22-year-old athlete, who has Filipino heritage through both her parents, made headlines with her astounding performances as part of Canada's relay team during the 2021 Tokyo Olympics. But she couldn't wait to dive into the pool for Team Philippines at the Asian Games. This marks Sanchez's debut competition wearing the country's tricolors, and expectations are high. She is poised to make a splash in the women's 50-meter and 100-meter freestyle events, as well as the 100-meter backstroke, where she could reign supreme based on her impressive Asian Games timings. Sanchez has the potential to break the nearly three-decade dry spell for the national swimming team with just one medal. 
Bringing home three medals would be a significant achievement for a swim squad that last tasted Asian Games gold back in 1982 in New Delhi, thanks to William Wilson's victory in the men's 200-meter freestyle. Heidelin Diaz Naranjo, weightlifting. Number three on our list is Heidelin Diaz Naranjo, a name synonymous with weightlifting excellence. She is the Philippines' first and only Olympic gold medalist, and she's back in the Asian Games after her triumphant performance in 2018 Jakarta. However, Diaz Naranjo won't be competing in the women's 53 kg category this time. She's decided to test her medal in the 59 kg division, aiming to secure an Olympic berth for the fifth consecutive time in the upcoming Paris Olympics next year. Diaz Naranjo achieved a remarkable feat during the 2021 Tokyo Olympics, clinching a gold medal in the women's 55 kg category. Nesthi Patacio, Women's Boxing Number 4 on our list is Nesthi Patacio, a formidable presence in women's boxing. Fresh from her silver medal win at the 2021 Tokyo Olympics, Patacio is on a mission to return to the Olympic stage and secure the elusive gold in the upcoming Paris Olympics next year. Her journey back to the Olympics hinges on her performance in the women's 57 kg category at the Asian Games. This year's Asian Games holds a special significance as it serves as a continental Olympic qualifier. It provides the easiest pathway for Asian boxers to secure their spots in the Paris Olympics, especially considering that the subsequent qualification meets will be crowded with boxers from all continents. Notably, despite being a former featherweight world champion, Patacio has yet to claim a medal in the Asian Games. Winning a medal at this prestigious event would be a significant accomplishment, and it comes with the added bonus of securing her spot in the French capital for her quest to transform Olympic silver into gold. Margie Lynn Diddle, Skateboarding Number 5 on our list is Margie Lynn Diddle, a skateboarding sensation who burst onto the scene with a bang. Her meteoric rise to prominence began when she clinched the fourth and final gold medal for Team Philippines in the 2018 Asian Games. Hailing from Cebu, this fearless skateboard warrior further cemented her fame by securing two more gold medals during the Philippines' hosting of the 2019 Southeast Asian Games in Tagaytay City. Margie Lynn Diddle made history by joining Christiana Means as the first Filipino women skaters to compete in the Street League Skateboarding World Championships in 2019, held in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. She proudly represented the Philippines again in the Tokyo Olympics, where she displayed her exceptional skills and placed seventh overall in the finals. However, the journey has not been without its challenges. The 24-year-old Diddle suffered a severe ankle injury during the Red Bull Skate Levels event in Brazil late last year, which required immediate surgery. Yet, she's expected to be in top form once again as she defends her Asian Games title while carrying the Team Philippines flag during the Hangzhou Games opening ceremony. Carlo Pa Alam, Boxing Number 6 on our list is Carlo Pa Alam, a rising star in the world of boxing. Carlo made his Olympic debut in the previous Summer Games and quickly became an overnight sensation by clinching a silver medal in the men's flyweight division at the 2021 Tokyo Olympics. Much like his fellow Olympic silver performer, Nesthi Patacio, this 25-year-old athlete from Talakad, Bukidnon, is eager to make his mark in the Olympics once again next year in Paris, with the clear goal of securing the elusive gold medal. Carlo is also determined to secure his Olympic berth through the Asian Games, which serves as the continental Olympic qualifier in the sport. However, the challenge has grown even more significant for Carlo. He was forced to move up from his normal fighting weight of 51 kg to featherweight 57 kg, after the flyweight division was removed from the Paris program. Yumir Felix Martial, Boxing Number 7 on our list is Yumir Felix Martial, a skilled boxer who transitioned to the professional ranks prior to the Tokyo Olympics, a move that proved beneficial as he secured an Olympic bronze medal. Martial, who had previously earned a bronze medal in the middleweight division at the 2018 Asian Games, 
has been eagerly awaiting a return trip to the Olympics in 2024 Paris. He views the Asian Games as his stepping stone to success. Juna Suki, Karate Number 8 on our list is Juna Suki, an exceptional karateka with a remarkable journey. Suki reached the pinnacle of success when the Filipino Japanese athlete secured a gold medal in the 2022 World Games, marking a turning point in her career. Her victory in Birmingham, Alabama, not only represented a triumph but also erased all the disappointments she had endured in previous tournaments, including her non-qualification for the 2021 Tokyo Olympics. Now at the peak of her game, the 31-year-old is on a mission to surpass her previous achievements, particularly her bronze medal in the women's 50 kg kumite category during the 2018 Asian Games in Indonesia, setting her sights on the ultimate prize. Juna Suki possesses an impressive track record to back her aspirations. She dominated her weight class at the Karate One Premier League in Lisbon, Portugal, in 2021 and earned a silver medal at the Asian Karate Championships held in Almaty, Kazakhstan, in the same year. Megi Ochoa, Jiu-Jitsu Number 9 on our list is Megi Ochoa, a Jiu-Jitsu powerhouse with an impressive collection of medals. Ochoa's latest addition to her medal cabinet came in the form of a gold medal at the 2023 Asian Jiu-Jitsu Championships in Bangkok, Thailand, earlier this year. This triumph marked a superb start for Ochoa and set the tone for her quest to surpass her previous bronze output during the 2018 Asian Games in Indonesia. Megi Ochoa has made the Jiu-Jitsu mat her own playground, where she has secured an astounding four world titles, two Asian Championships gold medals, a pair of victories at the Southeast Asian Games, and an Asian Indoor Martial Arts Games diadem in 2017. There's no sign of slowing down for Ochoa, who will be competing in the women's minus 48 kilograms category. She is even more determined as she prepares for the Hangzhou Games, where her chief nemesis, Cambodian star Jessa Khan, holds the title of defending champion. Ochoa's relentless pursuit of excellence continues to captivate the jiu-jitsu world. Kiyomi Watanabe, Judo Number 10 on our list is Kiyomi Watanabe, a remarkable judoka with a story of resilience. Watanabe's journey hit a hurdle after a shortened stint in the Tokyo Olympics, as she faced an anterior cruciate ligament injury in the lead-up to the 2021 Hanoi Southeast Asian Games. Additionally, her weight category was removed from the 2023 Cambodia edition. However, now back in her old brisk form, the 27-year-old Filipino-Japanese athlete is eager to make her mark at the Asian Games. In the 2018 Asian Games in Indonesia, Watanabe came close to clinching the gold medal but settled for silver. A four-time SEA Games champion in the women's minus 63 kilograms category, she faced a tough loss to Japan's Nami Nabakura in the final five years ago. However, she enters the Hangzhou competition as an even more tenacious grappler. Thank you for tuning in to part one of our series on key Filipino athletes to watch at the 2023 Asian Games in China. Stay tuned for part two where we'll introduce you to more exceptional Filipino athletes who are ready to shine and bring home gold medals for the Philippines in this prestigious event. As we eagerly anticipate the 19th Asian Games in Hangzhou, China, it's impossible not to be inspired by the remarkable Filipino athletes we've highlighted today. From the track to the mat, from the ring to the field, their stories of dedication, resilience, and unwavering determination remind us that greatness knows no boundaries. The Philippine sports history may have seen its share of challenges, but with these extraordinary athletes leading the charge, we're poised for a new era of success on the international stage. So, keep an eye out for these Filipino athletes at the Asian Games in 2023, as they aim to make their mark, break records, and inspire a nation. And remember, the journey of these athletes is a testament to what can be achieved with passion, hard work, and an unyielding spirit. So, stay tuned for the Asian Games, because these Filipino athletes are ready to shine and make their nation proud.
Thank you for joining us on this exciting journey through the world of sports. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell for more captivating updates. Until next time, this is Fun Fact, signing off.